So in this video, we are going to talk about how to install Metasploit in your device and fix Metasploit database not connected to Termux. If you want to watch Metasploit database not connected in Kali Linux, you can watch my previous videos and link is in the description. I want to let you know that we already have created so many videos on Termux and if you don't know how to install it, there is another video in the description and must watch it so hello guys and welcome back to efx tv and in today's video we will talk about another error which is unable to connect metasploit database in termux so if you are watching this video means you are going to fix this error today what about rest what about those users who are suffering from same problem and they are not able to reach to our video so this is my humble request to everyone please share this video as much as you can comment it down let me know your views in it like subscribe and share it with all your friends so that whenever someone searches about this topic our video should come on the top i hope we all are ready to support each other and thank you so much for appearing me so far without wasting any time let's get into the video and fix this problem this channel does not promote or encourage any illegal activities all contents provided by this channel is meant for educational purposes only In the right hand side, you can see that Metasploit is getting installed, but I'm sure that you don't know about M version tool. So let me show you how to install M version tool in your device. All you have to do is go onto the same link shown above, click on the repositories. Now Click on find repositories and search for Metasploit and click on Metasploit in Termux. Scroll down. So here you can see there are two scripts. Okay. So first script is for installing your Metasploit in your device. And the second one is for installing M version tool which will help you to update Metasploit regularly. I would suggest you to go for Metasploit once. Once you have successfully installed Metasploit in your device as I already have installed it, you have to click on M version tool. Paste it here and hit enter. Now type and version hyphen help and here you can see there are few more options okay so if you want to check for updates you can use this command so i hope it is okay that right inside metasploit is getting installed it will take some time meanwhile we should learn something else means meanwhile we should we should learn how to install m version tool to continuously update our metasploit on the regular basis okay so type m version and check it will check for metasploit updates now here you can see i have installed the most updated version so if in case you are going to get any kind of update alert here it will ask you to press yes or n to confirm it now let me show you how it could be
So here you can see the Metasploit finest version and most recent update. Now let me reduce it. I'm faking my term marks to believe on me. Okay, now let's try to run M version check once again. Now here you can see it says that update found which is 6.2.17. Here you have to press Y and hit enter. As soon as you press Y and you're going to hit enter, it will delete this directory from your this one. It will look for the same directory and if it founds it installed, it will delete it first. And after that, M version tries to install the latest version from the official repo of Metasploit. Okay, and this video is not over, so please stay tuned to video until we fix Metasploit is not able to connect Metasploit database or MSF database. So stay tuned, watch a full video to understand it better. So you have to type MSF console to start the Metasploit in your Termux. So Metasploit has been started now. Check for Metasploit database. So. This is the incorrect command, means I don't know about it. Now let me show you how to get the help commands. Type help and hit enter. Scroll up. Now let's type it. So here you can see there is an error, no database driver installed. Okay, so we are going to fix this thing exactly so quit your msf console get inside the home directory of metasploit now we will try to run a bash script which is inside this directory and known as msf db now here you can see the error now let's fix it by installing a simple germ. To install the Ruby germ, you have to type the same command in front of you. Germ install pg v space 1.4.2 and hit enter. So as if now this version is supported for Metasploit in Termux, I 
don't know about future, but if we are going to get some kind of error with this version, we are going to come up with update very soon. Now run the same command. Yes or simply hit enter. Let's start MSF console once again and check for Metasploit database is connected or not. Again, it will take some time. I would request you to wait for some time. Now right hand screen type db underscore status and here you can see connected to msf connection type post press quill if you are familiar with a rootless environment you may have heard that post press quill will never work on rootless devices so this is the fix in front of you if you want to watch some more videos like this error fixing troubleshooting kind of thing please subscribe our channel and let us know in the comment box that you have watched this video so this was it for the day take care of yours have a great time ahead